heaven as you stand in the presence of God who loves you and knows you, everything about you, beyond your own understanding, know that the holy covenant you are about to make is to be kept sacred and pure. Haley, I got to know you first in our small life group many, many years ago. And you know, in life group, we talked all things Jesus, but we also talked all things boys. And Haley, you knew from a very young age exactly who you might marry. And I have to say that I thought maybe this man did not exist. <laughs> but Kevin, the very first day that you walked into my house and we sat down together within 20 minutes, I knew that you were the anchor for this strong woman and that it was going to be your strength, your quiet strength, that was going to build an amazing home together with her. And I just saw it. I knew that you were the anchor. <laughs> oh, Dad, I didn't think I was going to cry. <laughs> oh, you. Oh, you. I love it. You look so <laughs> Okay, Kevin, the love of my life. <clears throat> I waited for this moment for a while now, even before I knew you. I waited for and prayed for this day. D Day, this day to stand in front of you, the love of my life, before God, family, and friends, and promise my life and love to you. I am so happy it is finally here. <laughs> Looking back, it is truly crazy we spent five years together in the same city at the same school, but never even spoke more than a couple sentences to each other. The Lord was still straightening both of our individual paths before finally crossing them later in life, and well, here we are. <laughs> After today, we will be building one life together forever, our paths eternally aligned. Haley, I love you forever and always, through the best times and through the hardest times. I will always love you. You're the most incredible person I've ever met. When I look back at the first time we met in Waco, I can't help but think about how God was there with us in every moment. It's funny and amazing to think about how that first moment together has turned out to be the adventure of a lifetime. I immediately loved your exciting, loud, <laughs> fearless personality. I was immediately impressed by how you're able to bring a light to any group of people. Even though we were purely just friends at that time, I like to think that's where our relationship truly began. Kevin, I knew long before we started dating that you were the sort of man I wanted to be with for the rest of my life. I'm the luckiest girl in the world to know and have the privilege to love Kevin Teague for the rest of my life. Thank you for being my best friend. <laughs> you love me in ways I don't deserve, but I'm blessed to know. As we know and have talked about many times before, marriage will be one of the most glorious things we ever get the privilege to experience while also being the reason for some of the toughest times we will go through as a couple, but I couldn't have picked better to meet. <laughs> With you by my side, family and friends surrounding and supporting us, and the Lord at the center of it all, I am confident we will do great things for the kingdom of God, and so freaking excited to do life with you by your side as your wife. Once we started getting to know each other more at PwC, it didn't take long for me to start falling for you. When I reminisce on our relationship, I love the strong friendship that we built before we started dating. my best friend. You are the love of my life. I'm so thankful for you. I'm beyond excited to love you, Haley. Thank you for making me the luckiest guy in the world. I can't wait to be your husband. You're the love of my life.